More motorways broke traffic rules last year, with the number of traffic violations increasing by 3.6 percent to 327,503, which works out to around 900 traffic offences a day. This is according to the annual road traffic report released on Friday. The news comes following calls for greater traffic police presence on the roads in light of the Tampanese accident which saw two brothers being killed after they were hit by a cement mixer. Road users still want to take a chance. Uh, when they do not see us around, they will try to uh, take a chance and uh, commit a traffic violation. Uh, and that's why we need to uh, increase uh, our presence on, on the roads itself, uh, whether is it through the use of technology or through uh, deploying, deploying uh, either traffic police officers or auxiliary police officers to help us uh, enforce all these traffic rules. But given the limited number of deployable officers, the traffic police will monitor the road situation by increasing the number of enforcement cameras on the roads and digitizing all red light cameras by 2014. That means that as soon as an offence is committed, the images will be sent back to the traffic police electronically. Accidents caused by motorists beating the red light also came under public scrutiny last year after the fatal Rocher Road crash in May involving a Ferrari and a taxi. Later in December, a motorcyclist was also filmed running the red light and hitting a female pedestrian. According to the annual road traffic report, there was an increase in red light running offences and speeding violations last year. But there were fewer traffic accidents, with 7,168 cases recorded, 9.6% lower than in 2011 and the number of fatalities also dropped 13% to 169. This year, the traffic police will broaden its community outreach efforts, especially to vulnerable road users such as the elderly and young. Three preschools currently have their own mini road circuits to teach young children about road safety. Besides the ongoing programs that we have with the schools and the visits to the road safety park, we are also going to, uh, in discussion with MOE, to customise certain programs uh, for the schools. And we have also started uh, some programs with the preschoolers uh, whereby uh, they are given uh, road safety tips even at a young age. The traffic police will also be engaging relevant companies to help spread the road safety messages to heavy vehicle drivers and dispatch riders. More measures will be announced soon.